Yeah. Um, I feel like there was a just a sequence of, of things that happened that were pretty unlikely, but things that we have to find ways to play through and just continually uh, find ways to get some outs. And, um, you know, it, it wasn't a night where teams were, you know, whacking the ball all around the park and you, you got to find a way to win. Uh, you got to find a way to get some base runners out there, move them around and, and get them home. And it was not going to be with doubles and, and, you know, a bunch of doubles and homers and, and that way. So, um, you know, you know, we, we get us, we get a strikeout and the ball gets away and the guy gets to first base. You know, we have one of the best defensive catchers in the league behind the plate. So it's not like, um, this is an issue for us, it, but it happened tonight. And, uh, you know, then we have a base runner out there, and um, then things just started. You know, a lot of the balls that were hit just, they weren't hit hard. They just found some space in the, in the field, and part of the game is putting the ball in play when there's runners in scoring position, and they did that a little bit better uh, maybe than we did today. Um, you know, if we play a little bit, I don't know. We just make we just make a play. We you know we block the ball. We uh, you know do a few things that we need to do. Probably in a better spot. Their guys had a few catchers interferences, and um, you know you can look at it one way and get pissed off at their guy, or you can look at it from our perspective, which I think is the better idea, and to say uh, you know we have to be aware of it and know that he's going to you know do that. I don't think anyone in the league does that on purpose, but. We don't see it very often, and to have a swing that does that, it's it's kind of odd. Have you seen a declined one before? Ever? No, that's the first time I've seen that in my life. But we got to make sure the guy doesn't get to third base. I mean, that we have to be aware of that and make sure that we're, uh, you know, we, we understand not just the rule, but you know what what to do. We can't just uh, kind of forego and you know we got to get back over there. There's a lesson there in finishing the play. Yeah, you always have to finish the play. It's something that you can be in the. I've been in the game for 20-something years. I've never seen it actually happen. So there's a lot of little things like that in our game that you got to be aware of. And the thing is, none of these individual things were the sole reason why we, why we lost the game. It was a low-scoring game. Um, you needed to get some base runners out there. And uh, like I said, they, they just found a way. You know, they, they just put the ball in play, and it found some space, and, and we lose. But... Um, you know, I'm not going to not going to point the finger at any one particular thing. Vintage Chris Sale. Looked pretty good. Yeah, he looked good, and he got us to uh, expand the zone. Is what he did. And if we stand there and you know do a, even just a little bit better job, I think of um, you know taking some pitches that are well out of the zone. I think we make his life a little more difficult. But that's what he does, and he's very good at it. He's his pitches, the strikes. Um, start out looking all like balls and the balls that he eventually throws all start out looking real juicy and uh you know he he he's really good about that and um he, he will get you to chase he gets a lot of teams to chase when he's going right and he looked uh he looked good you know i know he hasn't been throwing the ball that well but he looked really good tonight something could be said for how sunny kind of maneuvered through all that trouble to still put you guys in a position yeah the first two innings you know, they, they were a little bit upside down. They were a little bit of a mess. But um, to be able to come out after five, would he give up a run eventually, just a run? I mean, that's pretty it's, – it's, it's like, yes, it wasn't pretty, but it was like a masterful kind of deal to find a way to do that. Um, most of the time, if you're throwing the ball like that or you don't have a feel for what you're doing, you're going to give up a bunch of runs. Most guys would. But he battled out there very well. He gave us, uh, you know, uh, he, he kept us in, in a game. It's literally what he did. He just found a way to keep us in the ball game, let us tie it up, uh, and eventually take the lead. And a lot of that was because he got through the first two innings without, without uh, uh, you know, just kind of going away or, or losing it for a pitch or two. Um, he, he kept it together.